Hi everyone, hope you're all really well. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. Today is a bit of a organising day, not a cleaning day as such, just an organised things. So you know like when things just, you use things and it just gets a bit cluttered and then all of a sudden it just all gets on top of you. So today I'm going to have a good organise of the cupboards and just some of our storage bits that's just got a bit out of control like our cleaning cupboard there i've just wrote myself a list of everything i need to do so i'm going to prioritize it of things i can't do as easily when lenny is up he's currently down for his nap so things like cutting the grass and organizing the cupboard in the living room because if i did that when he was off he would just be straight in the cupboard so i'm going to do that while he's down for his nap um but yeah it's just a case of things have been getting used and we just dump things and it's just getting a bit cluttered and getting a bit on top of me now so i need to have a bit of an organize tidy things up a bit and have a fresh start of everything that's cluttered so i'm going to finish this coffee and then get a move on and try and get as much done as i possibly can Oh, my next job is to try and organise the understairs cupboard. I did it not that, not that long ago, but it's very quickly got out of control again. So time to give it a little bit of a sort out. And I'm hoping that this area can be somewhere I can put Lenny's toys for a bit of storage. Um, so we'll see what we can get done. I've got everything out of the TARDIS cupboard. It is actually a really big cupboard and it goes quite far back. I've just got the handheld um, vacuum cleaner down there and I've also got some board games and what have you. So I'm just going to give it a hoover out and possibly going to see if I can collapse that into two so I can wedge it further down there and then put some of his toys at the front. And this needs to go in the loft. My pregnancy pillow needs to go in the loft. That was a lot of stuff that I was trying to sell on Vinted. So I'm probably going to take that to the charity shop and yeah, hopefully get a bit more organisation going on in there. So this is what the cupboard's looking like at the moment. I've got currently this space empty and I've managed to split them drawers into two. So I've got one half there and then the other half is behind. The downside of having new builds, they don't have an awful lot of storage. So you've got to make the best out of a bad situation. Um, these drawers were from B&M a few years ago and these baskets are from eBay. If they're still available, I'll put the link down below, but they're just uh, they're brilliant for little storage bits. I've got some in our bedroom as well. So now I'm hoping to put some of Lenny's toys in here and try and get it a bit more organized and yeah quite a decent sized space though so this is our understairs cupboard now i have put his ball pit bag up there which is got a little command hook up onto the actual stairs and then i've managed to put a few bits in there for nice storage and it can easily get to everything as well which is great and then all my bits and bobs are at the back so yeah i'm really really pleased with that i just need to find a home for everything else now a lot of it does need to go in the loft but i'm pleased that we managed to get a bit more storage under there and i am thinking that we could maybe get some shelves to go up on the wall as well just for a bit more storage and maybe get a few more command hooks to hang things up but so far 
I'm really pleased with that and it's a lot tidier than what it was. Does anyone else have drawers like this? We've got drawers of CDs and we don't even own a CD player. What is the point? So I'm going to get rid of these because, like I said, we don't even own a CD player anymore. <laughs> this is an absolute game changer for your washing. Put it on your hangers, put pegs in between each hanger and you can get so much more on the line. My next job to tackle is either this area in the kitchen, so this is near our back door, and we just basically dump things there when we come in, or to tackle this cupboard. So this is again another understairs cupboard, and it's got basically all of our cleaning bits and bobs in the washing machine and things like that, but it's been used that much, and things have just been chucked in and dumped, so it's got a bit unorganised, so it's another thing I need to sort out, but... I think I'm going to tackle this one first and get this one done. Quicker and easier than what I expected and that basket now has just got the boys leads in and my slippers as well and obviously Lenny's changing bag these are just waning books that I haven't used and I've sold them on Facebook marketplace so I'm waiting for them to get collected this is a pile for the shed these are Ben's hats he had a good collection of hats in the basket so they can go up into his wardrobe I had some shoes in there so they can go in the shoe box bags of bags so they can go into the car and then me and Lenny's clothes that were just chucked in there, clothes, hats, scarves, gloves and what have you. They're ready to go upstairs. And then this is to be sent off to my friend. It's all of Lenny's birthday party decorations and my friend's using them. So I need to post them soon. I might go do that this afternoon. But that's that job done. And now I can move on to this one once I've tidied all this up. <laughs> Lenny's up from his nap now. He's just going straight to the cupboard to have a little explore of what's going on in there. I've had a few hours break, we had our lunch and then we've been to soft play for a couple of hours with our friends so Lenny is down for his afternoon nap so I'm going to crack on with a few more jobs, we've still got quite a few things to go on the list but I don't think there's enough hours in the day to get all the list done, like I need to go to the skip to take the old, that old computer but by the time I get the jobs done around the house probably going to be closed so that might be a job for tomorrow but now I am going to crack on with this cupboard and get this cupboard organised a bit more than what it already is because it's looking a bit sorry for itself. Can somebody please tell me why I need so many tea towels? That is extreme. This cupboard is looking much better, much more organised. So these shelves, Ben put them up for me a couple of years ago and it has changed this little cupboard completely because it gives us so much more storage options. And then we've just got a few baskets here. So this one has got our tea towels in and we've got the dogs bits and bobs in here. Just got the poo bags in there. And then we've got like the mop head, the brush, um, cleaning brush and things like that in this basket. These baskets are from B&M. And then we've just got like the laundry accessories and stuff in there. This little tin is from the range. And then we've just got like the laundry detergents over here, the cleaning pods. This is from Home Bargains. I think B&M also do them now as well. But we've got a few, many, a few too many pods in there and the lid won't close. Um, so, so down here we've got the dog treats. This is um, a tin from Sophie Allport. Really cute. And then I've just got my vases 
at the back there so yeah really happy that it's so much more organized and i just know where everything is i've got the mop hanging up there the sweeping brush and the hoover as well and then we've just got the ironing board on this really good hanger and it has the ironing um compartment as well so that saves a lot of space and yeah really like that so yeah really pleased that is another job done how come when you're trying to tidy up you do one room <laughs> and the rest of the house just turns to an absolute mess what is going on what is going on I, honestly it's the same in here as well but this is mainly lenny's toys so that's not too much of a mess but um you can see things stacking on the stairs waiting to go up but oh dear oh dear then he's up from his nap now so i've just put him a couple of toys in his cot and i'm going to sort out this pile of washing that has accumulated over a few weeks it's actually in one of his birthday bags and there's some birthday presents in the bottom of there as well somewhere so i need to sort this out desperately because it is getting way out of control <laughs> Oh, oh dear. Oh dear. That is looking much better, much more tidy. So I've actually just got a basket of toys up here for Lenny now, just so you can have a nice plate if I'm upstairs busy doing something or whatever. And then all of his clothes are put away. I do actually need to go through his wardrobe because all of this section doesn't fit him anymore. That was all the six to nine month clothing so they don't fit no more but i'm gonna save that for another day i cannot be bothered today at all um but that's all of his current clothing and then down there is clothing for him to grow into and he's pretty much in most of the nine to twelve month clothing no 12 to 18 month clothing now most of them do fit him so i'm gonna maybe wait until they start to outgrow to get rid of all these as well and just do it all in a one and get rid of them um his coat hangers, I got them from Amazon, but you can actually get the clips as well. So if I find one that's got a clip on it, this one, for example, it's a little pair of shorts as well. And you can just put the shorts and the t-shirts together. So it's just nice and easy to grab a full outfit. Um, there's a few different ones on here that are just like little outfits and just coordinated together. There's another one, for example, and it's just got the trousers clipped onto it. So it's just nice and easy. And then the little organizers I've got as well. These are from Amazon too. And they're just really good to know what age you're in and where to put things, what fits where. And yeah, them other ones is outgrown. So they're gonna have to go soon. But I'm glad I have got that job done because that is one job I hate doing. Are you making a mess of mummy's hard work? Yeah. You just get them all back out. I've just put them all in there. I've just used one of these clips to hang some of his teddies in that bag that's on the wall so basically utilizing the headspace rather than cluttering all down the bottom and i've been looking on ikea and you can get some shelves that fit this space they're like little cube ones so i'm thinking of getting like um four two and two and then we can put them up there and again utilize the headspace and yeah hopefully it'll be a nice little uh, toy 
situation for him if we get the shelves the ball pit bag will probably have to move but that's good for now really happy and these are brilliant i'm so glad i found some more i think i'm going to call it a day for today i have got a lot done but i haven't got everything done that i wanted to get done i'm just going to cook lenny's tea now so yeah i'm going to call it a day i need to do a skip run tomorrow because i've got loads of rubbish that needs to go and i've put a few things on facebook marketplace that we no longer need as well um but yeah i am overall feeling very pleased with the amount i've got done but there's just a couple of other bits that i still need to work on lenny is trying to climb <laughs> climb up the tripod you're all right thinking i might maybe do like a part two of continuing my little declutter mission and get oh <laughs> do you mind do you mind um yeah i might do like a part two of what needs decluttering and organizing so keep your eyes peeled for that if you'd like to see but for now i will uh, love you and leave you and i will see you all very very soon